Bauhaus was an experimental school for art, architecture, and design, founded in Weimar, Germany in 1919. World War I was completely devastating for Germany, and I think it really came out of this kind of utopian idea of rebuilding. The Bauhaus was revolutionary at the time because of the way it transformed art education, leaving the traditional art academy approach of copying older artwork and instead focusing on materials and form and colors and really starting from zero. Harvard was the site of the first Bauhaus exhibition in the United States. After the Bauhaus was closed in 1933, many Bauhaus artists emigrated to the United States, including Walter Gropius, who was invited by Harvard to chair the Department of Architecture. Harvard became kind of an unofficial center for the Bauhaus. Visitors will be surprised uh, by the diversity of the collection. Some of these objects are very familiar, but it's not just a collection of masterworks, it's also a vast collection of archival material and light-sensitive material. Things like Ani Albert's weaving submitted as part of her Bauhaus diploma, the Lucia Moholy photographs. She really helped construct the Bauhaus image. This year marks the 100th anniversary of the founding of the Bauhaus. This is really an opportunity in this centennial year to reflect on the role that Harvard played in the Bauhaus in the United States.